Welcome back to News Live at 6 with the cannabis industry on the rise. Syracuse University has decided to take part in it. Max Williams is here in studio to tell us more. Max. Yeah, Chile, the university partnered with Green Flower, an online cannabis training platform back in 2021. Since then, the program has, ha has made significant progress and is bringing the cannabis industry to life for Syracuse students. Industry is there. It's growing. It's the, the fastest growing in the U.S. right now. Those are the emotions of Nate Rowe, a managing director for Greenflower. No one really has kind of a formal background around the industry, how it works, and you know, a certain uh, kind of knowledge base that they need to be successful when they come into a new role. So Greenflower started partnering with universities and colleges, um, Syracuse, you know, being one of those. And, uh, you know, that's, that's really one of the ways we're trying to kind of legitimize the industry. That legitimacy has been a challenge for Greenflower due to the growing stigma behind cannabis and federal laws prohibiting much of what the program can do. But Greenflower's partnership with colleges and universities like Syracuse has made a significant impact. And we saw an opportunity for Syracuse University to be a leader in the space uh, and to help grow, you know, to your point or your question earlier about stigma, to really help grow this industry responsibly and sustainably. This is Jim Gaffey, Executive Director of Administration and Strategy for the College of Professional Studies at Syracuse. He has been a part of the partnership with Greenflower since the very start. He says the cannabis program adds an important aspect to the university. It's no longer kind of a fringe idea or a concept like th this is something that's here to stay. Um, and so we want to make sure that uh, students, particularly at Syracuse University, have an opportunity to participate and be successful. With the industry growing rapidly, Nate believes the future looks bright. Um, you know, New York is the industry is exploding there because of, you know, recent legislation changes. And, you know, now we have regulations in place. The first dispensary is open. You know, things are, are really changing. And if you're interested in learning more about the program, you can go to green-flower.com. Reporting in studio tonight, Max Williams.